I'm Gloria Starr, Global Business Coach. I've had the opportunity to travel to more than 60 countries worldwide in my 30-year career as a consultant. One of my favorite places to go, surprisingly, may be the Middle East. I have been working in the Middle East and Gulf region for almost 10 years now, and I have lots of clients and friends. My first experience was in Dubai and Abu Dhabi, and it was quite westernized, and I did not have to wear the abaya, which is what I'm wearing today. An abaya is a full coverage garment that the ladies wear, and it's like a, an elegant coat, and you'll notice on the sleeves just how beautiful they are. I have several abayas, and this one is my favorite. Now, when I worked in Saudi Arabia several times, I did purchase these abayas, and I wore them. And they told me it was not essential, but they would be more comfortable if I wore an abaya as well. And I did wear this abaya in particular as it's just so lovely. And I have a feather hat that's purple and black that goes beautifully with this. So although I may not always have covered with a hijab, which is this lovely scarf piece, or a burqa, which only shows your eyes as a woman, adding a great level of mystery. The Middle East has been incredibly good to me. I've had wonderful contracts with uh, senior management and presidents of large companies such as United Gulf Steel and Aramco, and I've done a lot of work for members of the royal families, training their staff to serve and care for them and the other royal members and their very high-profile guests. So with royal family members in Saudi, Qatar, Bahrain, Doha, and uh, Dubai, and of course Abu Dhabi as well. It's been marvelous. I like it so much that it might surprise you I could live there. So it's not really what we read in the newspapers. They have beautiful, vibrant cities. The homes and the palaces are simply magnificent. They have five-star hotels and restaurants. So should you decide to visit, I highly recommend it. One of the main focuses I've taken on at the request of American clients is would I teach them the Arabic ways so they would not make any faux pas when they were visiting. And I do a lot of work on that and I've also written several training manuals on how to behave as a guest in the Middle East. Gloria Starr, Building Bridges Between People, Companies and Countries, since 1983.